that juice. Hello everybody. So it's 10 o'clock at night and I just remembered that I hadn't done this for the day, but I am not breaking my streak. I have made it almost 40 days. Is it 40 days? I'm gonna check. Today is day 39. <laughs> I can I can use numbers. No, I really can't. But that's beside the point. It is day 39 and I'm not breaking my streak. Nope. Nope, not doing it. So, quick updates. I am officially applying to be a candidate for Teach More America. So excited! I got to talk to a representative a couple of days ago and she really encouraged me to apply and apply early so that just in case I don't make it this time I can be better prepared for trying it again um, at the next opportunity because you can reapply. You can apply twice um, and I'm going to do that and gonna be really exciting and she even offered to look over my resume which is amazing so I took a full advantage of that and sent her we had a really great conversation about equality and education so that was really awesome and I'm so excited also I am applying to be a Truett Center intern um, for those of you who don't know Elon University's workings, the Truett Center is the Religious and Spiritual Life Center at Elon. So what I'll be doing is uh, helping to plan religious events and spiritual events like um, panels talking about religion and education going together, um, helping organizations figure out stuff, and helping to plan Truett Center events like um, we'll be doing Holy Diwali, we'll be doing, um, oh, what's it called, what's it called, what's it called, I'm gonna, do, I'm gonna Google it, Eid, it's called Eid, okay, we're gonna be playing that, we're going to be doing a few other things, like, uh, the Jewish holidays, the Mardi Gras celebration, and we do luminaries every year, which is a lot of fun. So much hot chocolate, so much cider, so much putting lights everywhere, and candles in bags that just go all over campus. There are these two buildings. One of them is here, it's called the Movie Center. One of them is here, and it's called Alamance Building. There's a fountain, like, right here. And in between that is just space to walk, and that all of the pathways in between the Mosley Center and Alamance have uh, paper bags with candles in them, just lighting up the entire area there. And that's the main center of campus because on the other side over here, sorry, is the library. Then back here is the gym. And then there are like academic buildings over here, housing is over here more housing behind there, and more housing behind there, and then the business center is over here along with the Greek neighborhood. And basically the center of campus is right there. Ah, it's so pretty, it's so pretty. And I'm really hoping I get accepted because I really, really want to do that. Also, it's paid. Like the stipend they give me for each semester would pay for my books and give me a little spending money, which would be really nice. And as I'm actually considering not getting a meal plan, uh, I'd go towards buying food for myself. Um, I'm thinking of either going completely meal planless or like the lowest one. Um, just because I think it's time I start actually worrying about my own food and letting myself be in charge of my diet more um, because I mean going to f the food halls is independent and that there are a lot of options and just plenty of opportunities to either eat well or eat unhealthfully or whatever but I want to cook more I want to bake more and I'll have more of an excuse to if I don't have the full meal plan where I get to basically um, eat at the dining halls every day with all access, no problem. So, 
I think that'd be good for me. I think it'd be good for me. And having that stipend would go towards that, which is amazing. Ah, so excited. And I will be living with my dearest friend, Allie. She said, hey, my housing plan kind of went through and I know we were going to live together anyway, but let's just go for or just us again. And I'll be living with her for the fall semester. She will be staying abroad in the spring. RIP my broken heart. And we'll find a subletter. But I'm pretty easygoing, so I'm not thinking it'll be too big a deal to have someone else there. But it'll be fine. It will be fine. But yeah, I think that's good with my announcements. Other than randomly the story I started writing and posting online now has two followers and I was favorited as an author on the website, which doesn't happen. <laughs> so apparently it's going good so far. <laughs> Congratulations to me. But yeah, I think that's all I've got. Classes start again Monday. <sighs> Tomorrow was my last day of freedom because yes, I will be that melodramatic about that. And yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow and we'll see what I do with my last day of bliss. I'll see you guys then. Au revoir. Bye everybody.